All right, let's uh, get this on, or right, let, let me rephrase that. Get these 10 pallets off and get my uh, next load on. I gotta take two of these wooden suns that I brought down. I can take two off, set two aside. Everybody is having a safe 4th of July. Yeah, I'm recording this on the 3rd because I don't think I'll be doing much of a video tomorrow for the holiday. You never know. I might post a second one. Try to keep myself going and keep the videos coming. Yeah. Let me know in the comments. You want to do a see if it live stream on Sunday. I don't have a softball tournament this weekend, but I do have my daughter does have a uh, wrestling tournament locally. They're trying something this weekend. Try to get more kids interested in high school wrestling. My Sunday should be pretty free. Hey, if you would like to see a live stream, leave, also give me a good idea for a time frame for you. What would work best? I try to compromise and whatever majority majority of you want to want for a time, I'll try to uh, accommodate and see what I can do for you. But it would be Sunday. best I can do. I can't commit to anything on Saturday. My sat usually my weekends are booked so solid. But next weekend, yeah, next weekend will be softball again. Oh yeah, it's gonna be. I got softball for that the next three weeks after. This is the only week they, weekend they have off. So yeah, it's gonna be. Excuse me, quite busy for a while. But I'd rather see my. I'd rather keep myself busy with my child doing this versus them getting into trouble and doing stuff they're not supposed to. That one right 
right there. I think I think he's on the need on the other side, but that's alright. different but this stuff here worked burned like garbage in my stove my stove actually shut off because of it and if you go back and look at the video at the beginning of the January I posted uh, it was a clinker some hell I think I put on there customers burning those main woods stove broke. He had just astronomical buildup in his burn pot. So we brought him the creek. This here is kind of, this is a hardwood, softwood blend. I don't, I don't suggest blend, blended pellets. believers of it's either straight hardwood or straight softwood it's best for a stove blend uh, it's it's a fine line yes I know some people can say well it's no different than mixing uh, hardwood pellets and softwood pellets actually there is this one here, it's it's whatever they throw in. When you do a hardwood soft, 100% softwood. You know you're throwing in 100% uh, Sorry about that. I want to make sure I didn't hit nothing. So I got Cubex. It's mostly oh parent company for Cubex and does hardwood floors. When you get a mixed blend, it's whatever comes in on a truck. They take whatever they are running, clear it out in the woods and run it through the chipper and then just send it to the uh, pellet mill. It's not debarked or anything like that, like it is with Cubex. Cubex, where they run their, do their flooring, of course you know the no bark in that flooring. 
So you're gonna have 100% no bark. Main woods, as I said, that's just one of those blended ones. It comes in and it goes pretty much almost immediately into the mill. That's our last one of these down here. We got more up at our main store, but. Last one I've of these dug for. That duck fur is the best you can burn up here. I've said it many a times. One of the best ones you can burn up here. Actually, these two ones you're gonna put on this driver's side. I'd be done. So I don't have to worry about that, set it on the other side. Don't mind me, I've, I had a quick lunch on the way down. Trying to get, as I'm in a rush to try to get things done. And get off the road before a lot of the tourists hit for a long weekend. Shut the gas off. And the other view, if you haven't noticed, is right there on top of the machine. <sighs> Very top of the mast. Just let me know what you guys, what everybody wants to see for views or anything I can do to improve it for you. I know I ask it all the time and stuff like that. I just wanna make sure I'm giving all the best I can. Like I said, Wooden Sons, 100% pine. Main Woods is a 65, I think a 65-35 blend. Hardwood, softwood. I think it's 65 softwood, 35 hardwood. 100% dug fur. You cannot burn any better than that. And the first two pallets on the front of the truck. Those two right there, crab, those are Eastern white pine. I said, I think, come here, stop. Don't fight with me. Uh, I think with the crab, last I heard, I think the test results come back, they're like a 0.4 ash. I'm not on a, I'd have to make sure. It's, ow, static electricity. Uh, I have to make sure I make, double check, make sure I can see the lab results. I don't want to spread misinformation. I want everybody to get the truth. You get the truth from me. I don't. I won't sugarcoat nothing. I'll show you the facts, the numbers, everything like that, so you can make your own judgment. I'll tell you my opinion, and that's it. You do go from there. Oh. That's that damaged pallet I post talked about a while ago. I think that was like a couple weeks ago, I think. I still have still waiting on back from them about that. What they what they want to do. So I'm gonna make this I said I made this his own video. Just to fill in for a gap. My bar right here. Try not to crank down on these things too hard. You don't want to cut through the top of those bags. But then you make an absolute mess. 
You just want to snug them up. I always love burning, as I said, Doug Burr. Cubex is the other one I like to burn. However, Cubex is a little bit on the ashy side. But the Cubex and the Douglas fir are two of the hottest pellets that we sell. The Douglas fir is by far the hottest. Has like 9,200 BTUs and I think the last test results was like a 0 0.13, 1315 ash. Cubex, I don't have down here anymore. I, I'm out. I'm out down here. Cubex is like 9,000 BTUs. However, it's like a 0 0.34 ash. Oh, yeah, let me take this off real quick. So yeah, I'm just trying to be honest and upfront with everyone. I said the, the crab, I think is a point like a 0.4. I wanna look at the lab results before I give you actual saying, yes, that's what it is. This here, all it says is less than 1%. They're honest. It's like a 0 0.75, 0 0.75, 0 0.8 ash. I mean, it's one of the highest ash pellets that we, that's, we, we sell up around this area. This is the lowest ash. So we got highest ash, low BTU. I think this is like 8,400 BTU. Highest BTU, 9,200, 0.15 ash. Then we get the Wooden Sons. This is 8,800 BTU, 0.25 ash. So that's what I've got on the truck on this load. Uh, this load here, I think we got it as outside, inside, inside and outside i think or is it outside inside inside or is it i know this one says inside it don't matter i'm not gonna ramble on anymore so all right um i'm gonna grab the other camera here and we'll get going